It's my feel good breakfast show. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kat. You know what? It's been a phenomenal morning just celebrating Freedom Day, remembering Freedom Day, getting your comments on what Freedom Day means to you, and also just commemorating the fact that the first post apartheid elections took place on the 27th of April 1994. And we can't forget those heroes that fought for the South Africa that we live in today. And one of those heroes, of course, being Archbi Archbishop Desmond Tutu. Absolutely, hey? absolutely. We will never forget that Desmond Tutu's opposition to apartheid was always vigorous and unequivocal. He was outspoken in both South Africa and abroad. Um, he actually compared apartheid to Nazism. And um, the government twice revoked his passport and he spent a very short time in prison in the 1980s after a, hmm. a protest march. And um, yeah, he, he, was, he was outspoken for both sides. Absolutely. Against the, 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 the violent tactics of some of the anti-apartheid groups such as the, the African National Congress. And he also denounced terrorism and communism. So he wasn't one-sided in his approach. He always looked at both sides. I loved it. And after a year of attainment of the majority rule, Archbishop Desmond Tutu was appointed chairman of the TRC and uh, its jurisdiction included providing support and reparation for victims and their families as well as compiling a full and objective record of the effects of apartheid on the South African society. So he really did some cool work, man. And he's such a great guy as well. Yeah, such, such a well-respected man. I remember yeah. meeting him for the very first time three years ago uh, in Zurich at One Young World. Wow. And to have a thousand delegates from over 80 countries all across the world just watching as this man spoke and inspired and spoke of freedom and spoke of struggle, but most of all, speaking of love yeah. and the need for peace in the world that we live in. And uh, I know that he's very passionate about uh, the work against poverty yeah. and HIV and AIDS, and he also spoke about that. And then, of course, the very legendary <laughs> <laughs> the laugh, which I'm still working on. Wow. But yeah, it's such an inspiration. And uh, I think we have a lot of icons to look up to in our country, people that yeah. we should, you know, whose example we should follow when we're looking at building our nation. Yeah. I'm so humbled having just gone through their lives and what yeah. they've done for us. And I never, ever, ever, ever want to forget the price that they paid so that we could be free. That's exactly. Well, South Africa, price. let's go out there. Enjoy your Freedom Day. Let's remember the reason for the season, as they say. We'll see you bright and early tomorrow morning. We love you, South Africa. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye. My boo, yeah.